Hello guys, I'm going to show you how you can hack into any one mobile phone and track their location without even having access with the phone or without touching the phone. This is interesting, right? But remember, this video is strictly for educational purposes. Don't use this trick on anyone without their permission. Otherwise, when you get caught, you might end up in jail because it is illegal to hack into someone's phone without his or her permission. Please do want to subscribe, like, comment and share the video with anyone who need it or anyone who might need it to open our browser whether you are using your mobile phone or your laptop I recommend you to use uh, your laptop because it is easy for you to operate it first of all go straight to your your search bar and search canary tokens search for canary tokens or you can also visit their website at canarytokens.org canary the link i'll put it in the description so do well to check it out now go straight to the canary token and you see a search bar or a menu that will appear like this then that will tell you to select your tokens and provide an email address or a webhook address this email that they are talking about is the email that whenever someone track or whenever someone tap on the link that we are going to send to the person that we want to track or our target when the person tap on the link this message or the flashback link will what will let us that someone has tap, tap on the link then we will go and check the person to gather the information about the person so now let's open that there are a lot of tokens over here we have web bag we have dns token we have AWS token, we have Azure data, we have a lot of tokens that we are going to check it out. But we will choose one and you choose the remaining one. And remember, this video is for educational purposes. I will say it again because it's important. And that so so now we are going to choose the first one, which is web bag or URL token. Now, this the first thing that we are choosing. Because of educational purposes, we are going to use a temporal mail. To generate the email for us so that when someone triggers or when someone tap on the link that we are going to send we will get the mail over here because it's important not to use your personal email for doing such things like this it's very very important so now we are going to temporal mail so i'll put the link of the temporal mail in the description so you can check it out so when you go to temporal mail this is the mail that we have so let's copy it so we copy the mail, we go back to what? Canary tokens, we paste the mail here. Paste the email here. So this with this email uh, sent back message that someone has triggered the link that we sent. So let's put something here. When you come to the then after finishing filling the forms, uh, filling the forms, then what you click on create my token, my canary token. Now this is the link that canary tokens has given to you if you send this link to someone the person might know that no you are a scammer or you are using a phishing link to fish him or her out so what are you going to do you copy the link you copy the link you go to url shortener then you tap on the url shortener you yeah a whole lot of url shortener so you have btd and the other stuff so you pick any one that you like i'll drop the the url shortener links in the description so you can check it out now let's paste the url here and shorten it so this is the shorten url that we get we are going to copy this url that have been shortened now we open another browser then we paste the link inside because this video is for educational purposes i don't want to send the link to anyone i'm sending it to myself so uh i have this browser here let me paste the link here okay now i'll hit enter the link has opened and that's open it is saying fortune favor the brave yes which means this is not something that have anything it's just a tricking link so let's go back and see whether we are getting a notification that someone has tapped on the link so let's go to our template mail that we have an email let me refresh it and see whether we have an email that someone has what triggered yes this is the email that from canary token your canary token was triggered okay let's open it and see if you can get us some information wow like seriously so you know that we have a whole lot of information here that shows that even shows you the ip address 
the user agents and the canary tokens details and everything that you need here it should have some secret information over here so go back to manage canary token then you go to you go to history after going to history you see that they would you will see a whole lot of what informations over here you see that the person the location of the person then on it you see every details of the person then you copy the first one here you copy it from here then you go to google map so you paste to the login login to in google map then you hit enter and that is all for the video that is all on how to track any one locations using canary tokens and this when you send a link to the person the as soon as the person tap on the link then you are good to go you can track the location of the person even if the person moves from one place to other you can follow up this is a real life location tracking by the help of the canary best thing to do to protect yourself from location tracking or protect yourself from tracking your location is to turn off your location on whether you are using iphone or android phone the best thing to do is to what turn off your location and also within two days or in every day make sure you do what you restart your phone and this will help you to block anyone that is tracking your location I got a name called Cyber. I hope this video gets you well. Make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and share the video with anyone who needs this video.